Hi, I'm Stephen Jay, and I'm here today to help you understand how to use a deployant or deployment class, which is sometimes called. I'm going to be demonstrating it on a Versace Couture timepiece. The deployant class was first invented by Louis Cartier in 1910. The beauty of it is that it maintains a consistent flow throughout a leather strap, very much like a bracelet. Now, it's a wonderful way to secure the timepiece on your wrist, and of course, it's also aesthetically pleasing. Sometimes it might be a little bit complicated using, and that's what we're gonna explain for you here today. So, when you receive your timepiece, you'll notice that the deployment class will be completely closed. So when you receive your timepiece at home, you're going to notice that it looks exactly like this. You're gonna see a buckle or a tang attached to a leather strap. What we need to do first is we need to open the deploying clasp. What we do is we simply grab onto the leather strap with one hand and then pull, pull this buckle up and it will snap open. Now what I've got in my hand is I've got the buckle, I've got one half of the deployment clasp exposed, and I want to expose the other portion of it. And what I'm going to do is I'm simply going to hold it down with my thumb and fourth pointer finger, and then pull the opposite side. And now you can see the deployment clasp has been completely open. It's sometimes referred to a butterfly clasp as it mimics the wings of a flying butterfly. Now, everybody has a different wrist size. And what we want to do is size this timepiece, this strap perfectly to your wrist. What you do next is take your buckle or sometimes referred to as a tang with two hands, insert your thumbs on the exterior part and pull. That will release and open up the buckle and of course you see a pin right there. That pin is what is going to go into the corresponding hole on this side of the strap to size it perfectly for your wrist. I'm going to take the timepiece, flip it over as we now are going to join the two sides of the leather strap. Take this side that does not have the point buckle on it, bring it over, slip it into the buckle, and as you see, the mouth will, of the buckle will act, automatically open up and slide in the leather strap. Once you find the exact hole, simply snap it shut. Now, if you'll notice, we have a completed leather strap that we've now joined both sides with the, the deployment clasp. Next, what we're going to do is have you put it on your wrist. Once it's on your wrist, you're going to fold over the non-buckle side first and snap that down. You'll hear a click and that means that it's secure. And then to close the loop, we're going to take the end part of the leather strap, slip it into the strap keeper, and simply push it forward and down. You'll hear another snap. It's on your wrist and it's completely secured. You've got beautiful symmetry, very much like a bracelet, very, very comfortable to wear on the wrist. When you're ready to take the timepiece off, you simply reverse your action. What you want to do is pull up on the buckle, releasing the buckle portion, slip that out with the leather strap, then hold the deployment clasp with your opposite hand, slip a finger underneath, pull, and now you've just opened your deployment clasp again. You're ready to take it off. And that's what you do day in and day out. It's simply, for, first it's a fold over over the non-buckle portion of the deployment clasp, then a slip through the strap keeper, a snap down, with the buckle and it's secure and ready to go again.